G'day guys, well today's the day that I process the fish so um, I've got behind me here a table set up and I've got a makeshift whoops, that's a look, my makeshift net here um, to catch them and so I'll take you over and I've already I've already cut all the reeds back in here because that was really overgrown. Um, so that's this is all going to come out and get redone eventually when I move. So I'll swing you around and I'll show you the fish. Uh, yeah, here we go. You can see a couple swimming around down the bottom there. So I'll go switch the water off. All right, so, <laughs> this is a bit awkward. I've got the um, net ready. And so I'll scoop, cup, scoop one out. First one. So, let's see if I can get. So he's a nice pan size. Now this is a silver perch. Well, I've got to try and grab him without getting spiked. What I might do is I'll take him over to the table and. We'll show you. Oh, hang on, I'll see if I can get him out without getting spiked. You can. Here we go. That's one silver perch. And you can see the spines on his dorsal fin and the petrol fins have the same, uh, little bottom petrol fin. Uh, where are we? Oh, yo, 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 here we go. All right, I'll go and sort him out. Uh, and I'll be back in a minute and we'll catch some more. Okay, let's grab another one. Here we go, I'll take him over. I'll see if I can get a couple this time. Ah, good. Got two. Two. Okay. Oop. Where'd you go? These last couple are a bit harder to catch. Might have to let some of this water out, make it a bit easier. Oh, there we go. 
Uh, this one here is the barramundi. He's only very small. Hey, he just bit my finger too. <laughs> These ones here, you've got to watch their gill plates. They're very sharp. All right. So this guy, he could have gone a bit bigger, but um, he'll still pan fry up nicely. Because it's getting so cold here, he won't really do that well over the winter. So I'll process him and he'll be a little pan fried fish. But you can see those those gill plates are quite quite sharp there. And same as the dorsal fin's got another good thing. But Okay, two more. Let's see if I can get them in one go. One. Two. All right, that's it. Last two. Okay, so the tank's all out, emptied out. The fish are all laid out on the table. Uh, so yeah, I'll show you. It's all emptied out now. So let's go have a look at the fish. So here they are, twelve beautiful fish. So I've laid them out. The biggest ones are here. Uh, three about the same size there. Here's the largest. And then it goes down from there. Nice little pan size. These are all perch. And then that's the smallest one there. So you see by my hand, he's only a little tacker, but he'll fry up nice as a little snack. And the little one next to it. But the rest are good pan size. And the little barra. He'll be a nice little pan size as well. So I'll get into cleaning them out now. So all I'm going to do for cleaning them out is going to be uh, just scale them and gut them because I'll leave them as whole and I'll bake them. So it'll be pretty good. Yeah, so fish for dinner tonight. Okay, so let's start cleaning these fish up. Start with a little barra. Now I'm gonna get the scales off him first. Yeah, I just use the back of the knife. It's got a bit of serrated edge. Oh, I don't know if you can see it from that far, but that helps loosen up some of the tougher ones. And just the back of the blade is enough to do the rest. Bucket of water. I'm gonna rinse. All right.
Well, all done. So I'll swing you around and show you all the finished product. Here we go. Twelve nice fish. Alright guys, that's it, all done. So thanks for watching. Uh, if you like the video, please give it a big thumbs up and um, share it out because that'll help my channel grow. And also, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Uh, and all right, guys, thanks again. And I've got some fish to cook now. So see you later. Get going, get growing, and God bless you guys.